Looking for some entertainment? I need a ticket, please. Head straight through those double doors. Thank you. Welcome. Welcome, everyone. I am your host, Aldridge T. Abington. Thank you. Yes, Aldridge T. Abington. Few men have had a career more crowded with incident and various intercourse with the world than I. During extensive travel through this and foreign lands, I have procured a show so fantastical there exists Nothing like it. Anywhere. In an effort to bring this entertainment to even the poorest dreamer of dreams, I have determined the ticket price should be this very so low. And the show held without a profit to me. It's true. For it is blessing enough to bring these gifted artists to you. Give us some more. I discovered this next act in a tiny village in Italy. <laughs> Truly the most exotic of places in the world. Yeah. He was just a 10 year old boy. I raised him, I bathed him, yeah. I shaved him from head to toe. He is truly a wonder to behold. Presenting oh. Benjamin Lazarus. and mystical prowess, my dear ladies and gentlemen. Now, it's unfortunate fact that in this mortal coil we are all born to suffer from all manner of maladies in daily life. Who here has not had a friend or loved one near death's door from coal gas fumes, typhoid fever, diphtheria, or the bite of a rabid animal? The greatest wealth is your health. All the gold in the world cannot purchase it, and yet it is the most delicate and tenuous of all life's gifts. And nothing knocks down death's door faster than this. <laughs> a man cannot outrun a bullet. Many fools have tried and failed in this endeavor, including the tonic salesman I caught bedding my wife. I joke. I joke. <laughs> I assure you, he has met his maker, and they are playing gin rummy among the molten lava of Hades. Oh, I have We're traveled all, all around the world, this delighting young and old with all manner of feats of amazement, but none are as dangerous as what I am prepared to attempt tonight. I will hand this Didi Packenbush revolver over to my assistant and stand at considerable distance across the stage. She will point the revolver at my head and pull the trigger using lightning quick reflexes taught to me by a tiny man I met in the distant orient. I will catch the bullet in my teeth. Yes, 
Sharpshooting assistant would be so kind as to shoot this bottle of Lally Cola off my head. This is insane. Yeah! Off my head. This is insane. Careful. Yeah. I could do without a bullet in the brain right now. Hey! Oh my god! Oh my god! You all see this? <laughs> that this always scares me. <laughs> Now, observe, as I, the great Benjamin Lazarus, will do what no man has ever done, and cheat death! As if it were nothing. What is he doing? Christ. Let's do that again. Hmm? Right. Hmm. Oh, I'll take it. You're pulling my leg. This is a bunch of dang balderdash. Ah. Oh, damn. <laughs> a skeptic. Hmm? Ah. And Benjamin Lazarus, I assure you, I am not participating in some hoax or carnival ruse. These bullets How are 100%. In fact, I challenge any member of the audience to come forward with their own firearm, and I will yet again display my uncanny skill to catch a bullet in my Is teeth. Is no one man enough? I'm Fantastic. Yeah. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I will prove to you I am the greatest entertainer to ever live. And the only man who laughs at death. Now, ready? Take care. Oh, gotta fight is too much. Incredible. And fire. Just an illusion, after all. <laughs>